Oh, hello, beautiful people of the internet. My name is Ryan. Welcome back to Death's Door. If you're joining us on YouTube, you can say hello to Twitch chat. Twitch chat, you can say hello to YouTube if you'd like. Uh, we're back into Death's Door. We started last week in the middle of a charity stream. Uh, there are a few things different today. We're no longer raising money for charity. My hair is purple. Um, thanks to them. Um, thanks to the good people of, of Twitch chat donating so much money for such a great cause. Yes, I had to have an awkward conversation with my mother-in-law when she said, what's the deal with your hair? Uh, also, we have a dog cam on screen. I don't know if it's going to stay in that corner, but this is my dog, Hero. In the background is my dog, Kingsley. They're laying right behind me, and I have them on camera. Um, that We can see them just for today. We'll take it off after today's stream, but um, for today, we have it on. Um... I was going to say one other thing. Oh, yeah, there's a new emote in the chat, and there's a new uh, death counter on screen. If you type little into death in Twitch chat, I think it will work. Um, we've, got, we've got our bird with X's for eyes. Listen, I made a, I made a shitty emote in, in 30 minutes before stream. If you hate it, that's because I made it. <laughs> we've got a death counter. Carly, double check the death counter. We've died 10, uh, 10 times so far. So... Um, that's the uh, that's the update. Uh, let's play Death Store. I think it's gonna restart us back at the door that we were at. Thirteen point two percent. Oh, it just straight up tells you. The OBS overlay still shows tunic. Oh, why does it do that? Hold up, let me check that real quick. We're gonna get into the game. Give me give me two seconds. I refresh cache. Two seconds. All right, let's do it. It still does it. Damn, weird. Okay, the Ceramic Manor, the Urn Witch's Mansion. We need to remember what all we got. We got daggers. The last time we played Death's Door, let me see if I can give you a recap, mostly so that I can give myself a recap. Last time we played Death's Door, uh, we discovered we are a crow raven look at the little he head movements in the blinking oh my god it's cute i never looked at that before uh responsible for like reaping souls um we have big target souls that we need to reap and then there's a bunch of little guys that we that we destroy and they give us uh basically the ability to use magic um towards the end of the last stream we discovered a door that belonged to death, question mark? Death apostrophe S door. And we discovered an, a, a, a raggedy looking bird crow in front of it. Um, who told us we would need to get three very powerful souls in order to unlock that door. Uh, one at this camp, at this, uh, this witch. Uh, and two more that I don't remember off the top of my head, but I'm sure that I will find later. King to the east and beast to the west. We did a lot of good, uh, fun exploring. I feel like the, the best part of the game for me is just like the animation, the exploring, the like, just the gameplay itself is amazing. Um, absolutely amazing. So, um, yeah, we have made a couple upgrades. We have one crystal shard. I'd like to get more. Um, we have the umbrella. We have the Reaper's sword. I don't know that I, I read this part before. These blades are often favored by reapers that have defected from the commission or been fired. We got some incense. We got an engagement ring. <gasps> I don't think I read this either. Old engagement ring. This ring belonged to the urn witch. A gift from her late husband. It dates from a time long before you were even an egg. You were just a sparkle in your mom's eye. Your crow mom's eye. It seems she may have had to remove it because of her constantly swelling body. Such are the risks of living beyond your years. Such are the risks of living beyond, like, 25, frankly. Um, <clears throat> we did get some lore. Did get some lore. Okay. Uh, we were in the middle of uh, running around this, uh, this whole place. Uh, we also have Pothead. Our good friend Pothead is probably somewhere up here waiting to talk to us goodness look at the door the voids are starting to glow was that down to you then something you found during your exploration i don't remember the voice at all of course it was go on then onward to the other wings 
Perhaps you'll find even more. Bear with me. It's going to take me a second to remember exactly where we were. I think we were maybe this way. <clears throat> we were fighting like a spinning pot at one point, which was in this room. We made the chandelier fall. We went up this ladder. It had a whole like top area we could jump down from and then a door through here as well. And this is exactly where we was. Never mind. It took me no time at all to figure out where we were going. There's also... Uh... Okay. All right. I don't know why I just did that. I just used up so much magic. We have a, like, lantern room here, which is going to be interesting. We need to light things on fire. and uh, solve the puzzle from there. Range is 2.5. I wonder if we put this on, if we can hit them through the thing. No, we cannot. Okay, I was lost the entire time I played the game. My, uh, my memory is just not great. Uh, I'm really liking the like memory of the game. Sorry, the memory. The uh, Oh shit, I think I got a steam achievement. I wasn't looking though. I really like the rhythm of the game. The like, uh... You get magic, but you can only hold so much of it. So you sort of need to, uh... Refresh it constantly. Oh, I've got one health. Shit. No, oh, no! That's... Shit. <coughs> well. Little into death in the chat. We're up to 11. <laughs> you deaf. <laughs> Luke says, it's okay. Evo and Carly had to watch me figure out where I was after a five-month break. I love the magic mechanic. This is going to be a reference to another game and another playthrough. I love the magic mechanic, Luke. It's a real shame you can only use two pieces of magic at a, at a time before you have to refill it, you know? It's a shame you can only... You know, you can only heal like two at a time. <clears throat> Sorry, I got a tickle in my throat. Thirteen <coughs> percent done? That feels like a crime. I don't want to be thirteen percent of the way done. I want to be one percent of the way done so that I can play more. Oh, the fires stay lit. The beacons are lit. Gondor calls for aid. Takes multiple hits. So I gotta kill, kill him before they hit me. Okay. Oh, here it looks very comfy. These look like little flying uh, mankeys. Pots also give you magic. I need to remember that. Ah, you hit me through the thing. I call bullshit. This room is going to be the death of me multiple times. I wonder if I can light them on fire with a flaming arrow. We should try that real quick. I mean, it seems to work. And there's like, there's infinite magic. I don't need to be concerned with it. Ah, no. We're going to die. <gasps> those are not, those are not pots. Those are enemies. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We've done it. We've, we're, we're simply better. Those are not pots. Those are enemies. Come on, that looks oh, yeah, you're not a pot either. I forgot you were standing there. Get wrecked. Get wrecked. I was never in any doubt about my ability to conquer this room. Oh, we need to light the uh, cobwebs over there. Secret ladder? There's got, I knew there was something for lighting all the shit up, right? There's gotta be. 
Hero faked me out. I thought he was leaving. I thought that too. Okay. We got a secret ladder. See where it goes. Mm. That's just money, unfortunately. Money's great. It's how I upgrade. But... I would have loved uh, a shard. <laughs> Are you an enemy? What's oh no, you're a you're a plant. Thank God, because I'm weak as shit. Gotta burn the cobweb just in case. I'm playing two now, and I hate. I'm about to rage quit this stupid game. I hate this game. Uh oh. I have a meeting in 10 minutes. The Outlook pop-up jump scare. No. Oh, well, this looks... Okay, this is one of those souls. What a beautiful room. Look at the light in here. I don't think I tried shooting one of these the other day. But it doesn't look like it does anything. Oh, look at this skeleton here. Oh, that's sad. Hi, Rinstimps. Why did the door close? How can we get back? Okay. One more. Uno mas, as they say. Redacted area is the worst. Uh oh. Oh, goodness. You're not the cause of all this ruckus, are you? Hmm. I would not be very hospitable to any beast who would mistreat my children. Tread lightly, Reaper. I love that she watches you and that you can hit her. Oh. Why are you looking like that? Creepy. I love her design. It's really, it is creepy. This thing opened up. Hello, my friends. My Pikmin friends. Okay. Uh, we got one more. And I really honestly don't remember where we've been. Hi, what's the deal? Why you look so sad? How goes the exploration, my friend? This mansion is dark and full of sh secrets. Strange creatures, please stay vigilant. I haven't made a new companion in a great many years, so I do hope we survive our first adventure together. Forgets Pothead's voice, but this music gets you straight into her voice. Which voice is easy? It's, it's My which voice is the same as it always is. What the hell? Thank you for five gifted subs. Holy shit. Thank you. Can we get some hearts in the chat? Uh, to say thanks. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. If somebody has been magically transformed into a pot of soup, is it rude to reject the offer? Taste their soup. I feel like it's like tasting their... I mean... If a person has been turned into a pot of soup... Is it their spit you're tasting or what? It's probably their something, right? Is this the breast milk combo again? I've been here. Okay. Mm. The breast milk combo was more realistic. That's true. Is there another secret passageway over here that I didn't catch? Didn't remember? There's that door. There's this. I swear I've been up here. The 
This is where we got the, uh... Oh, man. My memory is bad. Um... Okay, up this. Hmm. He's probably pretty confused what we mean by the breast milk conversation. Yeah. I bet they are. I bet they are. Oh, you explode. I freaking forgot. I think I've done all this. Let's we'll just have to run back and double check it. Um we don't need to explain. It's probably worse if you do explain. <laughs> yes, I did this because I had to get on the bed to break the thing. Okay. I remember. Again, just to do it it's not gonna hurt i think that unlocked this uh sorry guys i'm just remembering how to play the game over here this this shit screwed me up but we definitely did this whole area how do i get this fourth soul that's the exploding one god damn it i do know how to ground pound now nice Wrong button. Okay, we'll just do a ground pound. This is the this is the way. They can't hit me if I just ground pound. This is so cheesy, but they can't do shit about it. I only have two health. Okay, we did all this. But I'm looking at like the chandeliers and stuff now to make sure there's nothing wrong. We're just, we do a little bit of backtracking, okay? Chat? Just a little bit of backtracking. There's nothing I can, like, burn with fire? No. Okay, this is where this was. Okay. Do a little bit of backtracking. Cheesing? You gotta cheese. If you ain't cheesing, are you really even trying? I find it amazing you found ground pound so fast. This is what happens when you spam buttons. Sometimes you get a little lucky. This is the door out. This is the door out. So now we go down here. This is the door to the room with where we were. I don't remember is where this goes. This is just the shortcut to the main lobby, right? The health flowers are so calming. They look as good as they, like, they look as good as they feel to use, you know? Please tell me I don't have to kill Pothead. Is that the realization? Is that the thing? I don't want to kill Pothead. Wait a second. Let's go the other way. Let's let's try the other thing. Maybe we missed something down here. Okay, broken shit in here. Okay. Okay. Spam. I'm getting spammed. I love that the pots like break over time. I love that they they take damage over time. It's really sad. Okay. That guy good? Is he dead? Dead? Okay, we did all this to break this. Cool. Oh. We're missing a soul. Is there a chance that it's... Hothead? Hopefully it's just something we haven't explored over here yet, you know? That could be it, right? We did this whole one.
Right, I just want to be thorough here. Hama. Luke's headed to a meeting. Sounds good. That's where this was. Okay. So, the little back thing right here. Don't remember where it goes. Oh, it drops you off? That sucks. Was not expecting that. Okay. Wait, I have a key. I'm an idiot, guys. I have a key. All right, we did a little bit. I just really wanted to show you guys where we were headed, what we did last time. I wanted to remind you all what we did last time. <clears throat> Get wrecked. We're on to the new stuff. We figured it out. Man, the shooting mechanic in this game is very, like... I don't know how to phrase it. It's, um... It feels like a high skill ceiling kind of thing, you know? I don't know if it is high skill ceiling, but it feels like it's multiple button presses to get it to work. Ooh, look at this. That's money. That's an upgrade. Like it requires, oh, shit, I should've done the other thing while I was down there. Gotta like draw it, gotta charge it to make it go quick is hard. Okay, there's one. There's a little uh, life seed thing right here. The answer was the door. God damn it, you're right. The answer was the door. Oh, he was... I just killed him with his own magical thingy. I killed him with his own admission is not the word that I... Is not what I was trying to say. Hoisted with his own petard? Is that the is that the phrase? <gasps> this one doesn't even have a head. Oh, when he doesn't have his pot, he's just a sad looking guy. <sighs> okay, we need one more. I think we could probably just do from here. Yes, you can. There's a command about overthinking, right? Oh boy, what is it? Um, there is. I will say, stuff like what I just did is why it takes me twice as long to play games as other people. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, we need to fire that ladder. To do that, we need to get up on this round, on this one, on that level. We also to do that from right here in the middle of the screen. We also need to walk around. Yeah, this is not bad. Ah, shit. Wasn't looking. What happens if you cut these plants? Nothing. Turns out. <gasps> Wrong button. Son of a bitch. Do, do, do. The music in this game is so... Uh, it's obviously worth um, praising. It's also just so calming. Or at least right now it is. Okay, that lights you. And then... That, I've already burned the thing. Is there anything I'm missing here in terms of a, uh... I have the... So, key is available. Let's grab it. Is there another one of these, like, braziers to break? Or to light on fire? Doesn't look like it. Oh, the brazier's what? I understand. The brazier's what unlocked the key. Okay. Do, do, do. Using the bow was really hard for my brain and fingies. It's very... Coordinated, yeah. I have five? We should absolutely plant here, and then we should eat. Pull the lever, Kronk. 
Shortcut. Shortcut? Music is one of my very favorite things about this game. It's a key part of my experience playing. Uh-oh. <gasps> it's the mouth. This music would be good D&D campaign music. I didn't mean to shoot that shit. We are getting free, like, um, getting free projectiles that we can use if we really want to. I don't think we should kill the other witch just yet because the other Wizro. Nope, gotta break the thing, gotta break the thing, gotta break the thing. Because I was gonna say we wouldn't spawn in new enemies, but of course we did. When we killed one, I thought maybe you had to kill both. Down to two health. Gotta get out of dodge. Get out of dodge. Okay, I broke him. Uh, excellent. Come on. Woo, the combat in this game is intense. We've done it. Jesus. Jesus. Okay. The final one. Free this soul. Bless your heart. Free your soul. She said I would live forever. But with a pot for a head? No thanks. I wasn't wrong. Pothead was turned into a monster. Oh boy. I was sitting there thinking it's the it's really sort of the only thing that makes sense. But that's when I thought that I didn't have a key to unlock that door. <laughs> what weren't you wrong about? I sort of wasn't wrong that Pothead was the final soul. I thought we needed to kill Pothead himself, but like the his form, their, their current form. But um, instead, I just needed to uh, find. If if you if the interpretation of that text is that person died, lit, their soul was sort of trapped there, and then they were they live forever in the form of pothead, which is how I would interpret it. Maybe that's not how you interpret it. Well, now, little crow, you have well and truly outstayed your welcome. First, you lead my daft grandson astray, filling that head of his with nonsense ideas about curses. Holy shit. Daft grandson? And then you come in here and smash up all my beautiful urns. I'm just trying to help people. If you set foot in my basement, there will be consequence. Oh, did I say basement? Shit. I shouldn't have told you where to go. Oh no. D oh. Forget I said anything. If you set foot in the rest of my house... I might even have words with your employer. Although I'd rather not see that old weirdo again. I mean, a lock for a head? So strange. Off with you, little crow! No, off with you, old woman. Hi, Zoobly, how you doing? Hello, hello. Hey, Pahe, we got to talk. We got to talk, bro. Bro, 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 bro. We got to talk, bro. All of the voids are aglow with unearthly light. Is it unlocked? If only I had a more complete understanding of doors. What? Push or pull? Twist the knob? Hit the handle? Before you proceed, Beakface, I have a confession to make. The old witch of this house, she's my grandmother. She cursed me with this ceramic cranium in a misguided effort to make me immortal. You see, she was stricken with grief when my grandfather passed and made it her mission to keep our whole family alive. 
forever. Her research led her to believe that replacing one's head with an urn would somehow strike you from death's ledgers. However, I resisted. And during the struggle, her spell must have gone awry, for as you can see, I have a pot for a head. I fear she has gone too far beyond her years and her soul has swollen and grown corrupted. I've seen it happen in this land many times. As a reaper, I implore you, end her suffering. Bring her soul into the next life. Perhaps she can find peace once again. We love a woman in STEM. <laughs> Once again, I will wait here and stand guard. May the doors of death be on your side, big face. Piehead's voice is not far from slipping into Kermit territory. I'm using him. I'm I'm doing Piehead's voice like a, a spirit fairy character now. I'm trying to remember which one. It's not quite. Um... Doors of death, be on your side. Hi, doggy cam. Kingsley, come here. Oh, big stretch hero. Commander, may the doors of death be on your side. Exactly like Buck. <clears throat> Alright, let's do it. Seems like a big boss battle. Be wary, living. Oh, this is the ancient door spirit. Be wary, living reaper. The door pushes me away. I love that. <clears throat> How are you liking Death's Door? I'm loving it. This is the short answer. Period. <clears throat> I get you. This is locked. However, someday, we unlock it and we can access the other area. Now that's a satisfying looking chest. Oh, satisfying mechanism. I was gonna say, we gotta kill the grandma. What do you mean? That's amazing. That's amazing. Can't be, it can't be treasure. Avarice. Oh, shit. I did get full health, which is good. Oh, boy. I love this arena. Oh, boy. You. Yeah. Oh, yeah. We haven't taken damage somehow, and I don't know how. Now we have. Okay. I love how the music mutes when you take damage. Ah, oh, shit. Ah, oh, fuck. Oh, Christ. Why did I say anything? I love their little screams when they die. We're so screwed. Is this wave one of four? One of the braziers became lit. Damn it. This music's great. The doors ask you to try again. Chat, what do you guys think? Can we run a, run a prediction? We'll do it again 100%, but we got to run a prediction. Uh, do, 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 do. The music is so good. I love that on screen, it shows up like a tunic thing. But on, if you're watching this on YouTube, we have an emote that looks like the crow. I, it's, I don't know why it's not showing up on, it'll probably just take a little bit before it shows up on the screen overlay, but. Oh boy. What do you think mods? Think you have the ability to run a prediction here? I can also run it if we need it. 
I'm going to check some stuff off of my, uh, my to-do list. Cobwebs and Witch's Place are done. I think we've knocked them all off. Charlie's on it. I love it. Tony says, wait, what? I'm here. I wasn't sure how to word it. I don't frankly know either. This just feels like a combat test. So I was like, let's try it. Um, hmm. Ryan survived. Does Ryan beat Avarice? I don't know. Does Ryan complete this challenge? There you go. Chance to predict. <clears throat> I don't know what is uh what all is involved in it, you know? It could be it looks like it's probably four waves of enemies. But there may also be a final boss at the end of it. I really have no idea. So, Carly knows what she meant by this challenge. We'll figure it out from there. Sometimes I'm doing work like reading an email and then I realize you're talking to mods and I have no clue what came before that. <laughs> How dare you do work at your job? All right, let's try it. Yeah, there's four braziers. Avarice. This is the Pirates of the Caribbean shit. This music right here. Dun dun da da dun dun da da dun dun da da dun. This is a compliment in my head. Dun dun da da dun dun. Okay, they give us ammo. Just use the. Use those. Don't hit me. All right. Full health. Full heart. Can't lose. Kill one of these bitches. Ah, you disappeared. Please die. Having two of those would be a real problem because they are fast. Where are you guys going? Oh, shit. You're exploding. I literally always forget those guys are exploding. All right, three health. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, I hit the wrong button. Oh, no. I love hitting these things into something because I think your slash can also damage something as it goes, you know? Like, if I hit a projectile, I'm pretty sure if there is also an enemy in range as I as I slash, that my slash may also hit them. Last one. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Nope. I need to... Okay, the big guy takes a big pause. So I think we focus on the little guys for now. And then we can we can hit the big guy later. Yay! I was trying to do a range attack. Firing a bunch of those at once is so satisfying. All right, we got this. I dodged the wrong way. Suck it. Suck it. This is the name of this boss. I've decided, by the way, is Hawk Tua. That's a terrible joke. Yeah, yeah. Be a real shame if I missed that. Oh. Dodge! Oh God! Dodge! Time to look at chat, see if they like my hawk to the joke. It appears that some of them do not. Let's go! Oh. Oh. A gift to a fellow crow to aid you on your, on your quest.
BK, have it your way. What? Flame spell has been acquired. Press switch to the flame spell. Switch back to arrows. Oh, I wonder what was going to be up there. Oh, baby. Ryan, be worse at the game. That took me forever. <laughs> what can I say? <laughs> but what can I say? What was that prediction like? How many people believed? Oh, guys. Wait, wait, wait. Hold up, hold up. Hold up. Everybody, everybody. Everybody chill. Uh-oh. He's looking at me. Everybody just be chill. 30% belief. What a good ball. I shouldn't even say that word. He's so good. It was actually even in terms of number of betters, but the disbelievers have more money to spare. Either that or the believers didn't believe hard enough. So here's my question. I really, and it's a rhetorical one. I really thought that was going to be me fighting the witch. But is this chest her soul? Is her soul avarice, which is sort of a, a type of... My understanding of the word avarice is a, a sort of like a sort of greed, right? Avarice, extreme greed for wealth or material gain. I wouldn't call that the witch's problem. The chest is, you know, me trying to loot from the chest and then getting attacked. That's kind of avarice. But the witch's problem is sort of a thing about immortality and, frankly, grief, right? Oh, wait. Maybe we still have a chance to fight the witch. There's still all kinds of stuff here. Never mind. I'll take that. Yoink. Oh, he's, he's resting his head now. He's resting his head. You know what? I could be convinced to have a dog cam uh, chat redemption. Um, maybe. Where I could put it on for a couple minutes if... Uh... The problem is normally... Normally, if the door is open, then they just sleep outside of the house. Like outside of this room. This appears to be a Reaper's abandoned logbook. We've been ordered to disconnect a series of open doors in the region around the recent anomalous energy surge. What a fantastic word. Anomaly and anomalous. This area had previously been quite active with commission members assisting the witch with her research. Immediate question. Oh, my pen is done. Is that not an amazing feeling? I, tell me if you disagree. I really like the feeling of a pen running out of ink. That makes me feel like I've done a good job. You know? What is the commission question mark? Why helping? Which question mark? I have that but with lip, uh, like with chapstick or lip balm, because I always lose them. If you finish a tube of lip, chapstick or lip balm, you are a superhero. I've never done it. I, someday I hope to, but I'm never going to do it. The order came through and uh, was executed immediately, so I'm not sure what has happened to the crows that were there. Well, I'm pretty sure they got they got died. Their asses got parked in the grave. All doors have been sealed for now. Outstanding work orders in the region have been manually closed. Quite strange, but it's above my pay grade. I find it's better not to ask questions. That's what they want you to think. They want you to not ask questions. They want you to be a sucker for the machine. That's what they want. I do. I, I'm not going to complain about these rewards. Lore and rewards? What is this? Christmas? The fuck is this? I have seen this poster multiple places. It looks like a Dark Souls character. The Keyhole Knight. I finished so many chapsticks because I have one in every room slash bag, so I never lose them. Really? 
Finishing a chapstick uh, tube sounds easy when you're hungry enough. Oh, God. Vaga. Ah, I see, I see you've been exploring the old office departments. I used to work over in the east section before I embraced my true life and quit the rat race. I'm much happier now, but that was one lovely, cozy office. Was it you who wrote the lore? Is that the... I think the insinuation there is that it was you who wrote this lore. Cozy office? That looks like a cozy office to me. Honest question, how many chapsticks have you finished in the last five years, chat? My answer, my honest answer is zero. Seems like you're finding a wealth of souls out there, Badger says. Where are they coming from? I haven't seen so much soul energy in decades, maybe centuries. I'm relieved. It was kind of like the world was getting, you know, stagnant. No new souls being made, which means nothing to reap and no rewards for us. I like that the Pikmin is following me. You wary exploring those old offices? It's fun, sure, but some of those upstairs don't want crows like us snooping around. <laughs> I finished half of a stick five times, but that doesn't count as one. You can't do simple multiplication. You can't. What's a chapstick? It's like a, it's like a, like a lip, like a, a tube of, I've got one right here and I never finish it. This one is Oregon strawberry ice cream made by Tillamook. This was a gift from Megan. But here's the problem. I don't really want to push it out. I'll push it in. No, that isn't good either because then it pushes the one thing out. It's, it's, there's no way it's even halfway done. And I've had it for here for a year and a half. Lip gloss? I don't know if it's lip gloss, but is it, I mean, my understanding of lip gloss is something different, right? Isn't lip gloss like generally a tube you squeeze it out and it's to put some shine on your lips? This I would say is more like for like, uh, SPF. So it's got like, um, you know, some protection. Um, we call it chapstick. I think to prevent your lips from being chapped or dry, I think is where the name comes from, a stick. Lip gloss is more liquidy. Lip lotion is factually accurate. It might be factually accurate, Tony, but I kind of hate it. It might be. State of the urn witch. I've heard lip balm. I've heard that too. Ceramic manor. There's an item down here. How do I get down there? Can I fall off that ledge right there? How do I get over here? There's a little phonograph. I can just go there right now? Well, then I'll go there right now. I can't go there. Son of a bitch. It's that broken thing. Orifice ointment? I... Lip juice? No, that's... Shit. We call it lip ice, time says. Lip ice for when your lips are dry. Lip ice is an amazing name. What a name. Lip ice. I'm not sorting out the paperwork for this. You better fix your own mess. Oh, wait, this is British Chandler, right? What is... Is Chandler Southern or British? I don't remember. Or, or nor. I'm not. I'm gonna make him Australian. I think he was both. Agatha is just old woman. I heard a rumor about a crow many years ago. This crow failed to finish their mission, and the door had to be manually removed and put in storage. They say the paperwork was beyond anything they'd ever seen before. They had to invent new forms. Three typists passed out from exhaustion. Oh, how I envied him. I love, here's the thing I love about the writing of this game. This office, the boredom, the paperwork, the tax forms, the, oh, this desk becomes my, it's got my items on it. Oh, that's neat. 
the mix the mix of like reaping souls and this high paced combat energy and then this uh this like IRS style there's a form for that perfect we got to do an upgrade i think we could technically do two no we can only do one damn it all right well let's take a magic i uh, maybe not i kind of want to be fast as shit Your dexterity i don't know who fucking knows Oh wait, I forgot the price goes up as you go. So that was actually 600. So I am not. I cannot do. Not do things. Um. Now here's the question: Where to next? I sort of have no idea. Grove of Spirits, Lost Cemetery. Comfy boy, he's very comfy. I. <laughs> can I break this pot? I should be able to. I can break all the other ones. Let's go back to the estate of the Ironwich because the basement is the thing, right? Basement was what we were told not. And there's also items over here. <gasps> I have fireball. Oh my god, I figured it out. Why isn't it working? You can run through them? That makes a lot of sense in hindsight. In hindsight, that that clicks. Ah, oh, Christ. Well, then what have I missed? I've probably missed something. WTF, I don't think I figured this out. Oops, sorry. Oops. Now I'm just going to look for places I can run into the... I didn't know that either. Hi, Mona. How's it going? You were almost cooking. I did cook eventually, just not in the way that I thought I cooked. Um, looking for grass. Sorry, I gotta go find my friend Pothead and I'm looking for grass along the way. Don't mind me. Grass. I almost got hit by that item. So this big door is open. Sure. Well, she said some shit about her basement. And this just took me to the other place. I'm a little confused. Avarice, the chest is gone. My every expectation is that I would fight the, um, the witch. This door closes too. It's a one-way portal. Damn. Tama? I know, right? Here's my quick question because I have a bad memory. Actually, let me get there first. And then I can show you. I have a quick front seat question because I can't remember. Oh, wait. I mean, that ought to do it, right? We'll be right back. Here's, the, my, here's my first front seat question. Right here, this path. Did I fully explore this path, chat? Yes or no, front seat question. Just a yes or a no. Did I fully explore this path? Well, one, two, buckle my shoe. Let's do it. 
Also, we... Of course we haven't, because we... Gotta do thing. Oh! <laughs> I love a secret. I love a fucking, uh, fucking secret. Oh, boy. Oh, you're gonna fall. Please don't fall. Oh, Christ. <gasps> you. I almost looted that thing, and if I would have, you'd have killed me. Oh, man, it takes long to charge this thing. It looks like a photograph. It is a photograph. Old photograph. Is it of the witch and her uh, husband? What a lovely couple. I wonder if they lived happily ever after. I don't think they did. I think they became a witch and uh, he died. Oh, boy. Man, this game is satisfying. Okay, let's fall down. This is all good. I wonder if that's the thing that I hadn't fully explored. Or if there was still stuff up here I hadn't fully explored. Well, so, now, so now we need to think about everything with new eyes. We need to go through everything with new eyes, right? Exclamation, read that. Oh, shit, I forgot. Thank you, thank you, thank you. An old sun-damaged photo of a couple at their wedding. A treasured memory of better times. It looks like... Wait, hold up. There's. I was getting ready to say, there's something on the back. 